So I've been asked the question, will the app still work if you fall asleep listening to them? Now, will your brain still digest the information if you're asleep? And that's a very good question. Now, when you're asleep, certainly um, there are still sounds that you can hear, which is why we can wake up if, uh, you know, if we hear noises outside, why parents um, can be fast asleep, but they can hear a baby crying and suddenly they're awake, but other sounds they'll be able to sleep through. So certainly you're able to hear things whilst you're asleep. And from that perspective, positive suggestions and soothing words and sounds are going to have a beneficial effect even if you're fast asleep. However, many of my recordings, many of the apps uh, contain exercises which require you to really focus um, on doing them in order to get the maximum benefit. So for example, if you're doing a goal setting process and, you're, and it's asking you to imagine yourself you know, in that situation where you've achieved that goal and how good that feels inside, if you're not actually doing that, you're not going to be getting the benefit of that part of the process. So visualization techniques, um, parts of the process where you're maybe having an inner conversation of some kind, if you're asleep, you're not going to be doing that. So therefore, you're not going to be getting the benefit of that part of the process. But posit positive suggestions, um, positive words, positive sounds, soothing sounds, they, they will all have an effect even if you're asleep. So there's nothing wrong with falling asleep listening to these recordings. However, you may not get the full benefit. So what I'd suggest is that at least on a few occasions, you maybe listen to them at a different time of day, maybe sitting a little bit more upright so you can consciously focus and work on the exercises so that you can get um, the maximum benefit possible. Hope that answers your question. If you'd like to know anything else, please feel free to ask.